with CorpusFishing.com with the Beach Pier and Surf Report. I just came back from the grand opening of the new Padre Bay RV Park and Resort. We are almost done with that. Look for more parking spots, updates and renovations galore. You'll see more of that on the news and in the local papers and on Facebook today. Meanwhile, in the fishing part of things, I talked to the folks, Matt, over here at Bob Paul Pier earlier. He says it's unbelievable. They've been getting uh, Spanish mackerel, whiting, trout, pompano, redfish, and even a few flounder. Pompano were biting this weekend down south on the Padre Island National Seashore. Lots of people getting pompano from the pavement all the way out down south, south of the Big Shell. Nick Meyer did well fishing at long distance with shrimp and fish bites on clip down rigs. The key for him was to get out long into the second gut and farther if possible. Normally you can find him in there. Uh, a lot of times they'll be in the first gut, but when they're not, you have to be able to go long distance and that paid off for Nick. Again, more snook being caught both at the jetty down at Mansfield and on the beach on the National Seashore. The most snook I have ever seen in my entire life. Lots of folks getting keepers in the slot range, so uh, don't be surprised if you see those. The fishing conditions will continue amazingly enough with seas and surf two to three feet or less through Saturday night. So if this is ever a pomp window, this is it. Good time to fish for trout, for whiting, pompano, uh, flounder, I mean it's it's Spanish mackerel, I'm sure there's bluefish and the jack should start showing up once that seawater temperature gets to about 68 degrees. We're about 70 now so we're not quite there yet. Down uh, up to our north looking over there at Packery they're getting trout, they're also getting a lot more flounder. My friend David Sykes made a post about catching some big ugly oversized black drum north of the JFK Causeway. That's a little bit early. Normally you see that around January and February. So everything is going off. The weather is perfect. Should be good through the weekend. For more information and to post your fishing reports and your pictures, go to corpusfishing.com.